Hidden Object Guru here with hot new game, Fishing Maniacs, Act 1, The Road to Extinction. This promises to be a fishing game that's also a tower defense game that maybe a zombie game. Hey, there's a YouTube button. What does that do? Goes to their YouTube page. Okay. Apparently it goes to their YouTube page, which is great. Um, I'm just going to start the game. <laughs> we can check out the YouTube. It's like, why do I want to watch a trailer when I can just play the game? All right, how do we play this? I assume you're going to teach me? No, oh, each place has no fishing. Tell me all about it, old man Jimba. Jimbo. Jambalaya. Okay. I don't think they've picked the right font. Oh, cool. So yeah, it really is real-time strategy. He will hunt them automatically. Okay. Jimbo. And yeah, let's start that wave. And I guess I can... Oh, well, there's a map! Mini-map! Nice. Oh, that's weird, that he's hunting them by throwing a uh, lure at them. Alright, I decided to send a second wave. Is that going to be a problem? or I probably don't have any area denial options. Can I speed this up? No, that's paused. Dear people making tower defense games, if you don't include a pause button, you've made... Uh, sorry, a speed up button, you've made a mistake. Come on, you can do it, Jumbo. I see now the value of being able to move. I can run ahead of the guys and keep going. Okay. Very chill music. Oh, do I have to... Wave is never going to start automatically? Okay. That's fine. Just realized... Oh, can I hire a second Jimbo? I can hire a second Jimbo. Oh, why can't I call in another wave? Is this the final wave and it just doesn't look like it? I was worried it was one of those situations where uh, each Jimbo was a specific character and we could only have the one, but that doesn't look to be the case at all. Supposedly later in this game we'll be able to build bridges and like fish from the bridge and cross over to the other side of rivers. It sounds nicely complicated. Oh, crap. Oh, this is bad. No, no, no. You deal with these guys while he focuses on that one. Alright. Now you focus on that guy. Alright. This is getting very dangerous. I can't let... Oh, wait. Can I let any of these guys get past? What is the consequence to me doing that? No, this one, you dummy. Then you can attack the guy you're trying to finish off. Which I now realize you'll be able to do. Oh, we don't get a zoom in to tell me what his powers and name is. I hate it when that happens. I enjoy knowing what the uh, various units' names and powers are. You can do this. You're almost there. Or are you? Okay, perfect. Cripples Creek. Oh, like the song. Cute. Okay. It's weird that it's foie gras and not caviar, because, you know... Pierre. Oh, and he's named Pierre. Oh. Okay. Alright, wider fishing range does more damage to bigger fish. Nice! Jimbo level 2! To start spear fishing? Cool. Alright. Press space on the keyboard. When you hover the mouse board, you can see the new upgrade statistics. Nice. I have to move the camera, obviously. I can see that. 
Oh, I can zoom out. That's even better. All right, so I'm starting with 37, so I'll get one Jimbo and one... Uh, oh, I can only afford a Herb. All right, well, let's start the guys, and then we got Herb in here. Second, I can afford him, which hopefully will be right away. See, I kind of like this idea of having a guy here doing damage to a big guy here, and then walking over the other side to catch him around on the other end of the map. 28, you can do this. 29... 30. What's your attack radius, Herb? Oh, a lot bigger. Now, how much do you cost to upgrade, buddy? Alright, spacebar costs 5. And that increases my radius. Wait, did it just say it decreased my movement speed? That can't be right. Range negative 3. That's so weird. To have it like a, an, a, an upgrade that actually decreases your movement speed. Second rod, nice. Two times three range movement speed, okay. Yeah, apparently it there are negative effects anytime you want to get an upgrade. I mean, who knew? Oh my god, he really does do a lot of damage to boss fish. Do I honestly feel a little silly calling boss fish? But yeah. Whatever. All right, get to it, buddy. Oh, now they can kill them with one hit. That's really nice. I could almost afford to upgrade this guy. That was a really long shot. Almost preposterously so. Can I uh, change your priority to get you targeting just the smaller fish? I can't, can I? I feel like a lot of small fish are going to slip by when I start targeting these guys. See, he still targeted that guy. On, I need to upgrade this big fish, er, man. A little faster, a little yes. But you said I needed fifteen. I have fifteen. What is happening here? I'm a little upset by this. Not very, obviously. But what's the point of having a second fisherman? Who you specifically tell me I can use to upgrade. Like, look at that. I have 15. Anyway, whatever. Uh, yeah, just, just walk over here and finish these guys off, would you? You deal with the next wave before I get overwhelmed, which is definitely coming. Wait, what is this circle around this guy? Can he not be hurt or does he heal or something crazy like that? Oh my god, he is getting away fast. I became overwhelmed immediately, didn't I? Finish him off! You can do it, buddy! Please tell me this guy gives you a lot of coins. Just like one or two. Four! Well, that's not terrible. Not great either. You, upgrade. Oh, and it's only five to upgrade? Yeah, okay, upgrade everybody then. Alright, so I'm going to do that trick I just learned where I, uh... Did I upgrade you? I did, okay. I guess I haven't unlocked the level 2 upgrades yet? Oh, whatever. Oh, crap, this guy again. Can I afford a second uh, big-time fisherman? And is this guy upgraded? Hell yeah, he is. I need how many? 30? Alright, well, maybe just another uh, regular fisherman to help out. Yeah, this fast fish is really frustrating. Especially since I'm going to upgrade this guy, right? Oh, no, he's dead. Why are you not attacking that guy? Oh, okay. I see. Alright, so I want you to get in here so you attack everybody the whole way around the bend. Come on, you can do this. To use the vernacular, get in your licks. Why are you attacking that guy way over there? More little fishermans. There's so many fish coming my way. I think they might have this, though. I would have liked to have saved up for another uh, low, uh, high-level guy, but it's just not happening. 
you guys got this guy, or do I need to... Oh, no, I think he's getting away. Damn it! I feel so sad about this now. I just don't understand what the green line around you means. Apparently, I definitely should have saved up for a... Uh... Another dude. And it's too late now. I've lost. Although they haven't really explained to me what the uh, stakes of the game are or what the penalty for me falling, uh, losing dudes is, so. I can only be so sad. Oof. This fish is so fast. And my guys are so slow. Oof. I guess maybe what could improve this? If I could see the damage appearing over guys' heads, that would be nice. We'd definitely enjoy that. How much damage are you doing now? I can't see your bait. Like, I can see what the upgrade effects will have, but I can't see what your stats are. Was it really a victory, though? Oh, there's a health in the top left telling me when I've run out of... Uh, the ability to fish. Alright, let's see what's next. Paging Dr. Jones. Okay. Arizona Joe. Oh. That's terrible. Good. Finally. What the hell? Alright, Dr. Jones. I can't afford you yet. Damage 3. 12! What?! Alright, which side are these fishies coming from? Oh, okay. Oh, like any real stra time strategy game, you can also grab a bunch of guys at once. I probably should have gra instead bought him and upgraded him. Because this guy, uh, an upgraded this guy, destroys fish in one hit. Which is a better use of my money, obviously. On faster! Other than I have the big fish to worry about. Also, those little fish are flying... Flying. Uh, swimming pretty close to the edge, and I feel it would be hard to grab them. Oh, whatever. Get that big fish, my good sir. Anytime you're ready. We got this. Alright, so, now can I... Get you further... No, I am not starting a new wave. You, do you get, are you going to give me a cash bonus for starting the wave early? No? Well, then why would I? It's the only reason to ever do that. Oh, well, it'll increase your point multiplier at the end of the level. Oh, so the people who check out the leaderboards on my demon fish fishing game can see I'm better than they are at it? Wow, these fish are good at getting away from me. Like, almost cartoonishly good. That's right, you thought you had me. You didn't have me. I got a dude with a wide fishing lens. Lens? What? And I just upgraded his... I'm about to upgrade his fishing rod. Eventually. A little faster there, buddy. You can do this. One more. There we go. Kaboom, everyone. And there's a new wave. Well, this makes him much more effective taking out the fast guys, but I'm still kind of stuck, aren't I? Wow, I am already lost a dude. I'd say this could be going worse, but I don't actually know that it could. Why do you only attack the most powerful guys that you have no prayer of attack killing? What is wrong with you? And now you just miss everything? He's he's pointedly not hitting the fishes. The chainsaw just doesn't work. <sighs> Did 
This game's charms are uh, are starting to wear thin by bugginess. Alright, so I'm gonna try something. First off, I'll start with Jimbo this time. And then I'll add this guy after five fish. And then I'll upgrade that guy's fishing rod. I mean, I'll start with a leveled up Jimbo, is what I was trying to say there. Two leveled up Jimbos? Maybe that's the answer. Anyway, I'm sure there's some combination of these guys that is able to get me through, but I don't immediately see what it is. I just hate how they fly further away. That's right, go after the hardcore guy. This time I want you to. Your buddy will take care of the rest. Seriously though, why is the camera ever zoomed in? Alright, so now they're going to kill enough fish to unlock my rescue guy before before they get down to the place, right? What's that? That's definitely not happening. I just needed to get another Jimbo on it. Okay, done and done. I got this. And I think nobody's gonna get through here. So the next upgrade for him massively decreases the range, so it's, he's useless. What? How is it fair? You know, why am I asking for fairness? It's a game about RTS fishing tower defense. I'm a fool to ask for fairness. And I kind of look like an idiot for even pretending fairness was a thing that was possible. So did... Did upgrading lower my range? Like, I know the chainsaw massively lowers your range, but did upgrading regularly open my... This was such a mistake. All right, can we try this one more time, please? Next. Okay. And then I'm just going to surrender to fate. All right, Jimbo. Wait, this isn't Jimbo. This is Herb. All right, Herb. Can you sort this out? Because I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just not getting money fast enough to get enough troops. You might say, well, then constantly redeploy your troops. Yeah, but... Using the regular troops, I can't do enough damage to get the other guys moving. Like, this guy's the only one that has enough range, and he immediately screws up by attacking the big fish. See my problem? Alright, let's try this again. What if I just constantly reposition him? Is that the trick? Okay, five more of these, six more of these, and I can afford a new uh, fishing rod. Is it 15? It is 15. Ugh. If these fish just gave a little more money, I feel like I would have this. 13. 14. And does it also increase my damage or does it just give me a second fishing rod? Because I'm fine with it if it just gives me a second fishing rod, but I do need to know that. Oh yeah, there we go. I mean, he's still useless because he keeps attacking the wrong guy, but... Alright, now to focus on the fishy. So, focus on the family reference. They're a horrible cult, a uh, horrible Christian death cult. Who uh, are led by a corrosive liar named Tony Perkins. Wasn't really the kind of thing I should have been bringing up in the stream. And I definitely shouldn't have explained it after bringing it up, so... Not feeling great about myself at the moment. Can you finish him off, please? Can you fish him off? Nope. Not a place for a pun. Okay, we can almost uh, afford an Indiana Jones. That's not true. It's like 50. Jesus. Alright, not a problem. I can't afford another new herb soon, right? Herb? Herb, buddy. It's not seven herbs and spices. It's a different thing. No, you fool, you foolish fool. Can I afford him now? No, it's tw it's 30, not 25. Come on, you got this. You got this, buddy. This is all you. If only you walked a little faster, I would feel like I had a prayer at this. Come on. What? Why would you try to attack that guy? 
All right, come on. Get in on this. You can help. You can save the day. You're the man. Fish up a storm, buddy. Oh my god. This might be happening. Ah, oh, damn it. There's another super fast fish. If I could just upgrade you, we would be set. And now I can do the two-man job that I've been doing. Where I move one guy, then I move the other guy. Well, I don't have to describe it. No! I missed clicking on him. Well, this is a problem. Nope, missed it. Well, that screwed up everything. Oh well, we had a, an incredibly brief good run going there. So his range starts at 2. Then what happens to it when I upgrade him? Oh, it goes down a lot, so you're actually not supposed to upgrade him on this map. See, that's information I didn't have. Quick, run ahead of this guy. I know you can't, so I don't know why I'm asking you to. So strategically speaking, you're actually not supposed to upgrade guys, like a bunch of the time. Because they lose their range when they switch from fishing fishing to pickaxe fishing. Alright, I feel like I got this this time. Like I'm just all over this one. Yeah, I think this game would have something if they put in allowing you to choose who to target. Like if you would factor that in, I think you might have something here. Also, honestly, show me his overall, not, not just the changes, but tell me what his overall stats are when I upgrade him. That would be fantastic. I only missed a couple of fish. How can you possibly afford an Indiana Bones character on this level? Sorry, Arizona Bones. Is Arizona Bones his name? Anyway, it's a reference to the zoo crew. It might not have been Arizona Bones. He was a dog, he dug up bones, was the joke. Oh my god, there's so many more fish coming. This is getting ridiculous. I so desperately need the Indiana Jones character. Hopefully he can get the job done. But honestly, even then... Oh my god, that catfish takes so much damage. Can we afford him? We almost can. Alright, we got this. Damage 12, yes! Oh my god, look at his amazing walking speed. He gets a gun? Faster, more damage, Indiana Jones! You can do this! I got a good feeling about this suddenly. I mean, I'm still probably going to lose the level, but it'll be a more ethical defeat than I've been dealing with in the past. Maybe get another couple of these guys out here. Can you do it? No, you can't. Not bad. Yeah, I didn't lose the level. I came really close. So yeah, I guess my uh, not so much complaint is just acknowledgement of this game's shortcomings is what they really need to do is like make it clearer what happens when you upgrade. Like what, if I thought I was losing 0.4, like how much of a loss is that? Like watch this guy, right? So I hover over, it doesn't show me what it does to the thing. More damage is great, but obviously it comes at too high a price. Also, when I click on this guy, show me his health. So I have some idea what's going on. You know? That that would help. Now there's gonna be two lines. Harry knew a guy, Craig Hamble, Billy the Bomber. Oh, cute. See, it's a reference to how people use dynamite to kill a lot of fish. It's disgusting. Nice. Thank you. He gets three fishing rods, which is pretty boss. 
Uh, Alright, so who are we going to start with? The bomber guy? Yep, that's who we're starting with. And he moves very quickly. About to say very fast, but obviously that's not uh, something people should say. Wow! That'll do nicely. Here. Giant monster fit. Really? I feel like that's... You didn't have that kind of range, but whatever. I want to get uh, an airy out of this, if that's at all possible. I'll take an herb. No, no, stay there. Stay there. You were doing great there. I'm having trouble clicking on dudes. Did I outzoom... Outzoom. Unzoom the camera too far? Can you unzoom his camera too far? We're not... Why aren't you attacking the guy at the front of the line? Have you never been a character in a video game before? Okay, dynamite guy? I hate to say this, but you are dynamite. You, upgrade to your two rods. Oh crap, it's the worst guy in the world. Speedy fish. Alright, I'm gonna need you to move down here and deal with speedy fish. In a second. And you move up there and deal with the non-speedy fishies. You have weird priorities, dude. Nope. Yeah, for some reason I could just never click on this guy. And I wish I had a reason for why that was happening. I just don't. You got this? Why are you attacking the single weak fish? Who's behind the other fish? Alright, I have a plan. Let's get another herb in there. Oh, good, it's a fast guy. Then I need you to get enough money to upgrade this guy to two fishing rods, and then... Well, we're going to be cooking with gas, is the point. Can you handle that, please? Apparently you can. Nice. Come on. No! God damn it! We were so close. Why are you walking way down there? Alright. Second fishing rod. Go! I'm just going to let this fast fish go. Like, there's just no way. Actually, you know what? Maybe. I might have this. So next, an Indiana Bones, because he sprints around the place really quickly, so I can use him to catch the uh, fast fish that uh, run past everybody else. Yeah, it seems like uh, Explodo Dude here, you want to use him to uh, do a lot of damage right up front, like as much as possible. Yeah, you have strange priorities, dude, and that isn't changing. Oh, can I get a third fishing rod? It costs 15. I want Indiana Bones instead. Alright. Because you're going to take care of my catfish issue. Catfish you? Ugh. Even I wasn't proud of that. And I'm famous for hating puns. Wait, that doesn't make sense. It's like you don't know what even means. Oh god, it's golden fish. That doesn't sound good. Or look good. Alright, you. I want a third fishing rod. You. I want a second fishing rod. Oh, I, I already got you one of those. Alright, you. Take on the new boss fish. You. Dynamite the other fish. This guy moves way too fast for his own good. Well, no, for his good, yes. Actually, he moves at the correct speed. For my good, no. Did I not just upgrade you? See, this is where it would be great for you to tell me how much damage I was doing to him. That would be awesome. You gave me a lot of stuff, didn't you? That is three catfish at once. This is becoming a nightmare. Made flesh and steel. Is he only one of the... Oh, he's holding one of the fishing rods on his feet. That is adorable. Oh my god, way to go, buddy. Can you take out the fast guy? Well, that three fishing rods is fantastic. And I missed the last guy. 
Because of course I did. This seems weirdly doable. Can I afford another bomber? Because another bomber would be fantastic. I can nowhere near afford another bomber. Alright. Can you finish this guy off? I know you can't attack while moving, but if you could, that would be amazing. I can get another uh, Indiana Jones coming out here, but that's not what I want. Another, another Explodo Demon. Yeah, these guys are definitely getting past me. Like, the dynamite fishing is awesome, but these guys are up here definitely getting past me. Yeah, what are those big red fish up there? Snappers? Are they snappers? God damn it. Oh, a new Explodo dude. Oh my god, I bet I can attack both sides at once with this guy. How did I not notice that earlier? And use it to my advantage. Sloppiness? Just basic sloppiness? Oh, okay. I thought Indiana Jones was much faster than this, and I realized I was zoomed in much more than previous levels. Yeah, you're not going to pull it off, buddy. Just get up here and see what you can do to stem the tide of death coming the other way. Nope. You. You help out. And immediately get upgraded. And immediately get upgraded again. Okay! You know, I'm starting to see where this game would be a manageable experience. Like, paying the correct amount of attention, really getting into the game systems, I feel like this would definitely be, like, doable. Like, you could get good at this. I still have my complaints about some of the key elements. You know? I get the, the lack of... Come on, you can do it. Come on, Indiana Bones. You got this guy. Like, it not showing damage, not letting me see the enemy's health, that kind of stuff. That It still bothers me, but it's not a deal-breaker by any means. And, like, I still think this is an okay game. I think it could be probably express itself more clearly, be balanced a little better. But beyond that, you know, I think I'm down for this largely. Also, that thing where he still gets to do one hit at whatever guy he was targeting before you moved him. That's just a glitch that needs to go. Alright, so I think this is going to be a great place to stop. I have been the hidden object guru. I'd like to thank you for coming along on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more, I would uh, suggest uh, checking out elsewhere on this playlist. There are any numbers... No, playlist. Uh, of, yes of new and upcoming games on there that may or may not interest you. I'm hoping more may, but I'm not going to tell you how to live. I'm going to tell you what you're allowed to enjoy. Uh, questions, suggestions, entries into contests, requests, all of that stuff. Sorry, all of that jive goes in the comment section below the video. I will see you back here for, as I said, more new and upcoming games. But until then, au revoir.